Look at this. It's a bag in a bag, it's a bagception. Look at this order. Everything at McDonald's Switzerland. Come on! We love food? Yummy! Look at this order. We did it. Everything at McDonald's Switzerland. Dessert will come later. It's still in the fridge. Wanna start? Let's dig in. Quinoa burger. All right, first we're gonna try the only vegetarian option they have at McDonald's Switzerland, quinoa burger. That's in the green package. Let's see how it looks. Cut it into two. All right, let's check it out. It's like some weird vegetables inside the quinoa burger. Let's think it and sink it. What do you say about the quinoa burger? Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. I actually think it's not that bad. I just have like mayo. Mayo and some vegetables. It's okay. Next. Another one. Next burger on the list. Big Tasty. This one is huge. This is the Big Tasty. Like a classic burger. It has a special sauce in it. This is how it looks like. Let's go. Mm, this one's good. Didn't see. Next one on the list, Cheeseburger Royale. Woo! That's like the same burger as the Quarter Pounder. Just we call it Cheeseburger Royale in Switzerland. Another one. Mm. That's the burger. Meat, ketchup, onions, cheese. That's it. What next? Signature burger. This one is special in Switzerland. We already reviewed this one. Uh, if you haven't seen on our other video, uh, check out on the link on the top. I'm reviewing McDonald's signature, the farmer burger. It looks amazing. Look at this signature burger. Mm. Let's go. What, what do you say about this one? So far the best one. For me, it's competing with the quarter pounder with the cheeseburger royale. There's a lot of meat in it, I love it. The next burger is gonna be the CBO. I'm not sure if it's available everywhere in the world. So this is the CBO burger. It has chicken in it, fried chicken, and some bacon on top of it. I will eat this burger alone. Mm. With mayo, pretty good. It's a really big burger. I like it, it's pretty similar to the McChicken, I would say. Next. Next one on the list is the wings. They call it chicken wings. They are not the chicken McNuggets. There's something else. So let's try this one with sauce. Which one do you like? Let's try the curry sauce and the deluxe creamy. Curry sauce and deluxe creamy sauce. This is how they look like. They're like regular chicken wings. Look a little bit dry. I tried without sauce first. Yeah, first without sauce. Cheers. Cheers. Oh, wow. Huh? Mm -hmm. I'm kind of impressed. I never had these before. They're not dry at all. Good taste. Good spices in it. Mm -hmm. Had some kick. Good seasoning. It's actually really good. I think I will order them again. The next one is going to be the chicken nuggets. Thank you. Classic chicken McNuggets. Standard. I think they're everywhere the same in the world. Let's try the sweet and sour and the mustard sauce. I will try it without sauce first. Cheers. Always good. It just works. Let's put the sauce aside. All right, next burgers are going to be special. We ordered regular cheeseburger and the other one is the gluten-free cheeseburger. We're going to compare these two and see what's better. So as soon as you take them out, you can see the difference with the bun. Maybe not in this the camera. This one is gluten-free. It's quite no. different. It's a little bit harder than the other and one. it's brighter. Yeah, the normal one is soft and the gluten-free one is a little bit spongy. Which one do you want to try first? I'll take this one. Gluten-free first, all right. Gluten-free burger from McDonald's. Let's dig in. Mm -mm. No? I don't like it. Not for you? It's too much bread. I just got the taste of the bread in my mouth. The bread is harder, I think. Mm -hmm. Harder to bite. You have more bread flavor in it. It's not so soft. Gluten-free doesn't work for me. Regular cheeseburger. The classic one. Classic. Challenge. This one is just perfect. Filotish. 
Or let's double it up. Filet of fish. Filet of fish. Next burger on the menu, filet of fish. Filet of fish from McDonald's. This one is the first for me. You already had this one. I love it. It got a nice texture, good sauce, and there's also a little bit cheese in it. So let's see. Let's go is. for it. It's really good, actually. I mean, I like fish, I like fried fish, so this is basically it. The sauce is good. It fits quite well with the cheese, but I don't think I will order on my own the filo of fish. I will still go with all the burgers. But it's healthy, it's fish. Now we go with the signature burger from McDonald's. It's the all-time classic one, the Big Mac, the one and only. One and only Big Mac. There we go. Classic Big Mac from McDonald's. Enjoy. Enjoy. Mm. Mm -hmm. The sauce is so good. The seasoning of the meat, the sauce, it's just perfect. So good. Next up, we're gonna try the fries with all the dip sauce. Where's my fries? We have four different dip sauce. Now we're gonna try each one. Let's start with the mustard. I actually like this one. But it doesn't taste like the normal mustard, you know. It's a little bit different than regular mustard. It's like honey mustard, like a mm -hmm. sweet mustard. Sweet mustard. Let's go with the next one, curry sauce. My all-time favorite one. Yeah, mine too. This one only exists in Switzerland. The curry sauce, it's amazing good. If you pass by, you need to try it out. The sour cream sauce, it's good as well. I think if you have potato wedges, a little bit better. It would be better with some wedges. Yeah. And the sweet and sour sauce. Mm. This yeah, one like no. It. For me, sweet and sour needs an Asian dish to work, but not like this. And it's way too sweet. Yeah. Next one is the McBacon. Uh, this one has beef in it, bacon and a special bacon sauce on top of it. I will eat that alone again. Do you see the sauce? This sauce is actually amazing. It's not as good as the Big Mac sauce, but it's really, really delicious. What is the taste of it? Is it more spicy or is it a little bit sweet? It's really fatty, it's a little bit sour and like buttery. And you got a different bun like the other burgers. You need to take a quick look. True that, the bun is like a proper bread bun. Breakfast bread bun, something, whatever. We're getting uh, low on burgers and we just figured out they missed something. They messed up. McDonald's. We wanted to review every item on your list and now the McChicken is missing. I was so excited. They gave us two times the McBacon, what he just tested now. So, yeah. So let's try another burger. We go for the next one, the Signature. This is the Signature Farmer Burger, I guess. Nope. This is the Signature Regular Burger. We had the Farmer before. And this is the one without cheese. So let's try it without cheese. This one has like a ketchup sauce in it. Barbecue? Barbecue, oh, like yeah, that, yeah. yeah, barbecue sauce, that's it. Yeah, the sauce is definitely not ketchup and definitely not barbecue. It's something really special, really sweet, probably a lot of sugar. It's the same bun like the last one. It's the brioche bun. Cheese, cheese. It's way too sweet. The sauce is compared with the sweet and sour sauce. Yeah, the sauce messes the whole burger up. Yeah, it's just a barbecue sauce with too much sugar. Yeah. Next up, we're gonna have the regular hamburger. One time regular hamburger, one time gluten free again. It's actually the same case again. Special bread, a bit hard. It's not as dark as the other one. Let's go gluten free first. Same problem as before, the bread is too hard. I mean, if you're allergic to gluten, you can have this one. It tastes like the regular burger, just the, the bun is different. The bun messes everything up. It's actually a shame for the classic hamburger. The good old-fashioned hamburger from McDonald's. Classic hamburger. And again, the magic trick. We're getting low on burgers. We have two more. McMuffin. I actually never had this one. Did you have this one before? I never had the Egg McMuffin until now. We're gonna try it. All right, Egg McMuffin. This one actually has no beef in it. It has just an egg and okay. cheese. Different bun. Different bun. And actually this is only for breakfast, but luckily they gave, we could order it as well. I like the bun. It's like your typical good morning breakfast bagel. I think for breakfast, this totally works. It's awesome. Last burger already. It's about to get down. We saved one of the best for last. Double cheeseburger, baby. Last burger. 
all items on McDonald's, double cheeseburger. Cheese. Mm -hmm. This is so good. I prefer this one 10 times more than the regular cheeseburger. Yeah. It's way better. Mm -hmm. Just double cheese, double meat, same ingredients. Absolutely amazing. Good bread, onions, cheese. All right. We had every single burger there is from McDonald's, including snacks. We're going to be coming to the dessert in a minute. Which one is your favorite? I would say the Big Mac is quite high. I would say the Big Mac and the double cheeseburger is on the same level. Those are in the top three. Afterwards, I would go for the filo fish. I really like it. And also the Mac chicken, but unfortunately, but maybe next time we can show you the Mac chicken. I agree with you. For me, best burgers, also same level, Big Mac and double cheeseburger. These two burgers are amazing from McDonald's. If you're in Switzerland, get them. So good. Want to have some dessert? Yes. Now it's my time, because I got the sweet tooth. We're going to start with mm, the hot goodness. It's the apple pie from McDonald's. All right, this one's the apple pie. It's so good, because you got inside the pieces of the apple really nice crunchy in the outside and I'm not quite sure but I guess it's cinnamon inside as well and I love cinnamon. the taste yep so let's go for it let's go. Mm. you know what it's still warm mm. I love it I love that should I tell you a secret come closer there's even a secret item on the menu from McDonald's and almost nobody knows it you can get the apple pie with a sundae in one plate it's called the secret apple pie sundae menu go for it Next item on the list, Nutella Donut. It's the best donut from McDonald's. Nutella is always a good choice, man. Let's dig in. All right, look at that. Nutella filling in it. You got even the Nutella wrapper in it. So if you got the possibility, try it out. I think it's only available in Switzerland as well. Just, mm. oh baby. Nutella Donut is amazing. It's so creamy and so like, like the regular Nutella what you got at home. Now we have the cold stuff. We have milkshake. It's a McFlurry with brownies inside and a little bit chocolate sauce. Strawberry sundae. Which one do you want to try first? I would say let's go for the sundae. Never had it with strawberries. All right, all right. Sundae with strawberries. You can go first. It looks like it got even strawberry pieces in it. It has some strawberry pieces in it and I love them. Good, right? It's not bad, it's not bad. I love the sundae anyways. Sundae is always good. But it's too sweet. Too sweet for you? The strawberry is too sweet for me. I'll go for the sunny chocolate one. Or even the sunny without any toppings. That's a good choice as well. Let's go McFlurry time! This one is special one. The basic McFlurry is always with M&M's. And now at the moment in Switzerland we got a special one. It's with brownies and chocolate sauce. Oh. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. What's a little bit unfortunate are the brownies are very soggy. soft. Yeah, yeah soggy. they're soggy, they're soft, they're not... If it would be maybe with Oreos, it would be a little bit more crunchy. Maybe it's because we waited too long to eat it. So probably you should eat, eat it right away. Yeah. And the last item from McDonald's is the... Strawberry milkshake. Take a bit. I take it from the straw. You got a similar taste like the strawberry sundae. That's the sugar I need. Alright guys, that's it. Every item from McDonald's Switzerland, we're pretty full. What do you say? We had ups and downs. I need to say the first burger, the quinoa burger was, yeah, I expected that, that taste and I expected that it's gonna end up like that. Yeah. It was the worst, basically. Yeah. This one at the farmer with the barbecue sauce, the classic. Right. They forgot the McChicken, we all know how it tastes like, so we know the taste, but quite unfortunate because we were really looking forward to it. We will eat the rest now. Uh, there's no food waste at all. We had some assistance here to help eating. And that's it for today. We love food. Yummy.